your major doesn't matter. Okay, hear me out. I'm going to have people flanking me in the comments. Oh my gosh, that's so stupid. Of course your major matters. Look, if you're not going to be an engineer, a doctor, nurse, or like a lawyer, it doesn't matter. Okay, let me tell you why. I graduated college early. I graduated in three and a half years at like a really well-known school, very competitive school, very proud of myself, with a political science major. You want to know what I wanted to do with that? Nothing. Dang. Do you want to know what I regret? My major. Not because it's not useful, because I think I actually have a lot of skills from it that are very useful in everyday life, but because I just, it wasn't enjoyable for me. Also, I'm walking on my treadmill very slowly. It wasn't enjoyable for me, okay? Okay? But let me tell you, I am an exceptional writer. I, for my entire college degree, have been writing research papers, synopses, capstones, everything. I'm an incredible writer. I know. And that's the thing, like, Writing is, a, is I think, is a valuable skill, right? I mean, some people may disagree. And obviously, you know, when it, when it comes to AI, chat, GPT, I mean, these things, you, you, you have to worry about that threat. But I think writing is, is, is a valuable skill that you can definitely, like, use and, and bring to the marketplace. Like, I'll, I'll share with you a quick story. Like, back in 2016, when I started um, trying to make money online with affiliate marketing, I hated writing, right? I thought writing was boring. It's just something I wasn't good at. It's not something I like to do. I know even in college, I wasn't good at it. So I was just like, I don't want to do it. But I said, all right, Ralph, if, you should, if you're going to try to make money online, then you're probably going to want to have to learn uh, the skill and learn how to do it. So I said, all right, cool. This is what I have to do. So then I started writing blogs uh, on my website. And, you know, I started off with a 500 uh, word uh, blog. Then I went to 1,000, 1,500, and eventually went to 2,000. And I got better each time I kept writing. And I probably wrote like like maybe 400 uh, blog articles and I got better. And even though I didn't like write it, I was seeing that I was getting better and I was getting results and I was making money from it. So it was a skill that I was developing at that time. And eventually, I mean, I don't do that anymore. And now I've, I've moved over to, to the YouTube space where I, I did videos. And believe it or not, I didn't, I never liked you doing YouTube videos as well. Like I never, I'm not a big talker and, you know, speaking in front of the camera was something that I never wanted to do. But again, I said, all right, Ralph, if this is, this is a valuable skill that you want to learn, if you're going to try to try, try to make money. So this is something that you want to learn. And I've gotten better as time go, gone by as well. Like if you look at my first video, I had my, my camera phone and speaking in, in my car and, and, and what? 400 videos later I'm I'm you know I'm, I'm I've gotten much better when it comes to communicating I'm still getting I'm still growing as well and I'm learning how to get better skills and, and learn how to communicate better and bring um, uh, more value to to the people that watch this video and 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 hopefully you get I get the results and the results have been showing you see more views you get more people watching more people commenting so these are skills that you want to develop and and even though um, you know you like when it comes to the to, to bring value in the marketplace you want to you want if you want to make money you got to learn how to develop skills Skills. And, and when it comes to writing, obviously, like this is this is a skill that you can bring to the marketplace. And like I said, you gotta worry about AI, Chat GPT. Even in the video space, you worry about that. But I think the one thing people love about when it comes to YouTube is authenticity. And I don't think uh, you know AI, you know, can can replicate that. So um, yeah, it's all about developing those skills. So let's see what she got to say. How to analyze data? Do you want to know what I do for a living? I work in social media. Do you want to know what you do in social media? You have to be creative. You have to analyze data and you have to be able to write well. You have to be able to research things. So whenever I've applied to jobs and they're like, ooh, actually you don't have a marketing degree. Do you want to know what? I have four years of experience under my belt in social media marketing. And look at it. And, that, and, that's a, and like I said, and, that, and that's the problem with college. Pro college doesn't teach you these skills, right? They don't, they don't, they don't teach you skills. You know, a lot of people say, oh, but it le le learns how to, you know, communicate with people, be around people. You don't need college for that, right? You don't need to. Just enter the world, go work, and you'll learn these skills as you go. You don't need to go to college and uh, spend tens of thousands of dollars in debt just to learn these skills. You can go and develop these skills, so you don't need a degree for that. And I think the good thing is, I think a lot of, um, I think companies, I'm not sure exactly which ones, but I think Walmart is doing it. They're removing that uh, requirement that you have to have a degree in order to get employment there. I think it was maybe uh, maybe man corporate management or something like that, something somewhere I read that, where they're removing that need for uh, a degree in, to, in order to get employed. And hopefully more um, companies go this route because the fact that you it, it forces people to have to go to these colleges and, and get these useless degrees and get into thousand dollars of debt just to get employment, I don't think that's right. I think developing skills is one of the most important things and I think more colleges are doing that so I think I think people are realizing that and, and seeing that you know it's more about the skills rather than um, the level of, of you know degrees that you get within create incredibly good results in social media they 
your degree doesn't matter okay it doesn't matter do you want to also know what i'm doing with my time with my degree and my incredible writing skills i'm writing a fantasy series a romantic series actually and that's what i'm doing with my time social media and writing novels but i have a political science degree okay this is what i'm saying y'all like unless you want to be a doctor and want to cut people open you know i recommend using some youtube videos to learn skills that you want to learn okay there you go. Exactly. That's right. Focus on skills. I think we need to get um, to this more, right? Instead of saying, all right, 18-year-olds, you're right out of high school, go, high school, go straight to college, right? And then you graduate and then you, you find that, that whatever you learn in there is, not useless, is useless and you're like, all right, why can I find employment? Man, right after high school, I think we should be getting to work, developing skills, finding out what we like, what we don't like. And, and as we want to gain, um, you know, advance in our careers, then we can go and search uh, the, the certificates or the degrees that we need in order to, 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 to increase our, in place, uh, our place in, in that company and make more money. So I, th I think that's important. And look, it, another alternative is, is, is the Internet, right? If you want to make money, use the Internet. You can reach more people. Right. No longer do we have to limit ourselves to regular jobs. Not that there's anything wrong with that. If you're working a regular job, that's cool as well. But you see so many people struggling with the fact that, you know, especially, you know, young students coming out of college, that they're getting out of college and they're still finding that they need experience in order to get these jobs. And the fact that, you know, it, it seems like even though they, they did four or five years of school, they seem that they're still not able to 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 have the skills in order to get these jobs. Um, and, and I think. We just and, and you look at inflation, you can see that these jobs are just not compete, com, com, just being able to um, compete with the inflation, right? These the wages are not increasing at the same rate as inflation. So I think it's important to look at use the internet. There's more reach. There's more, especially if you have valuable skills. If you're someone that likes to write, if you're like someone that likes to speak and communicate, you have some information that you can share with people. Use the internet. People are you know love the authenticity. They love finding people, and you don't need millions of followers, right? You don't need millions of followers. You just need a group of people that like what you have to say that follow you wanted that that like to, to to have you know hear what you have to say and then you can do well with that right no longer do you have to just resort to just the regular nine to five job or any other job like i said there's nothing wrong with that we need people that do that but if you're someone that's just you know what that says you know what that's struggling to find employment or is struggling to to to, to, to get a job that's going to pay you a, a decent wage use the internet does it does it take time is it easy no but it as like with any skill it takes time you have to develop it over time like i said i was never a good writer but i continuously wrote article after article uh, hundreds of articles later i became a better writer not a great writer but good enough to to get results and the same thing with youtube being able to speak in front of a camera now am i a great communicator no but i i communicate well enough to to get my point across and obviously the results show right i do get views um you know subscribers are growing and these are skills that you have to develop stop looking towards just uh, limiting yourself just a regular becoming a, a nine-to-five employer working a regular job you don't have to do that there's alternatives if you're someone that's struggling with the way the economy is going with inflation everything is uh, the way everything is going then you got to find alternatives they're all they are alternatives there are different ways to make money just stop thinking that your regular job is the way to go because there's different ways to do it you just have to have to have to figure out. Like she said, she has the skills in writing. Like she's she's developed skills in social media, right? She went to a job and said, you know what? Oh, she doesn't have a marketing degree, but what she does is she has four years of social media experience. Now she didn't say if she got the job or not, but I'm pretty sure she went in there confident and she knows what she's talking about. And if you a job sees that and they say, All right, you clearly have a resume where you you've done this before, you've been doing this for a while, and even though you don't have the degree, you do have the prerequisite skills in order to do the job. And if somehow she needs a, a marketing degree if the, to, to get a, a higher higher uh, uh, management position or whatever, then I'm sure she'll do it. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, but she understands that she brings value. She has skills. And that's what's important, guys. You have to develop the skills. Develop the skills. Stop thinking that um, you're, something is owed to you when, with these jobs, right? They, if you can bring value to a company, if you can bring value to anywhere you go, if you can bring value to the marketplace, you are going to be rewarded. This is what people want. People want to see people that are going to help them. Are you going to bring them some type of value into the marketplace? People will reward you if you can do that. If you think it's just supposed to be given to you because you exist, that's just not the way the world works. People want people that can help them and bring some sort of value to the marketplace. And if you can do that, um, and if you have, if you can't do that, then develop the skills in order to do that. Whether it's through speaking, whether it's through writing, uh, whether it's through anything, develop the skills and you will see yourself um, get better results um, in your life. So. Those are my thoughts. 
Um, make sure to leave a, if you have any, I want to hear your thoughts, make sure to leave a comment down below, hit the like button and share. And if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe. All right, so you guys take care and have a good one. Later.